Hello and welcome. Uh, this is a tutorial based research channel and um, what I normally do is, um, well we will get there, um, is uh, show you uh, the research in action, the research results and ultimately the channel is here to show you how you can start researching this stuff yourself. Um, okay, right. This is a bit of an experiment. I'm I'm gonna wing it, um, but I thought I'd give it a go. Um, gonna go and see if we can find any anomalies on um, Google Mars. Um, sorry for saying um all the time, but um, there you go. That's just the way it is. Um, a couple of years ago, um, I went mad. On Google Mars I've got loads of stuff and I will be showing you at some point I uh, because I'm a little bit up against it with time and stuff um, I've just done a video so I thought I'd uh, give this a go so I'm sort of aware of areas of where to look um, but I'm not entirely sure uh, where I found stuff so we're just going to go and have a look um, if you've never done this before I would go for the dark areas there's a lot more contrast and you're more likely to see stuff so um, let's just go for it oh this is something I I showed um, a while back on one of the one of the videos hopefully the these, uh, where are we? Da, 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 da. And how do I get rid of them? Because we need to get rid of them. Dig towards our smoke, rovers and landers. We want that. Oh God. Where is it? Basically all these lines uh, are the the areas that have been um, photographed and you should be able to keep those. Um, Oh, spacecraft imagery. Okay, see, uh, there we go. Um, so these are the uh, different orbiters, and it's quite incredible. Mars has been so. Um, There must be, you know, millions of uh, so all these areas are what have uh, <coughs> been um, photographed. Uh, it's quite incredible. So let's just. Um, Yeah, again. I mean, and you're trying to tell me they don't, that there's nothing there. There's been rovers there for 20 years and there's nothing there. It's absolute twaddle. Okay. I hope I can remember how to use this uh, program. <clears throat> okay, where are we at? 391 miles. Okay. 
Okay. Now for me, straight away, this looks like it's, um, this looks very familiar. does not look like a uh, all these shapes and stuff here here everywhere look at this Now you'd think I'd be crazy to say that these are structures of some description, um, but purely the fact that I've been doing this for quite a while now, this is absolutely screaming at me, I'm really surprised. Um, So what I was thinking of doing is taking a screenshot and then going back into GIMP and then seeing what we can find. Uh, this it, it's everywhere. There you go. Let's uh, how do we do the uh, I haven't done this for ages. Why isn't it um? Normally I have to correct the um, this sort of bird's eye view because it always it always wants to give you an angle. Um, don't know. Ah. Okay, so let's have a look in the uh shows you the last time I used this. Let's see if it makes any difference with this. Now, base color of imagery. <clears throat> Very few, um, <clears throat> 
doesn't really tell me uh, where I am. We know we're in the northern hemisphere. Let's have a look in there. Now, if you've seen any of my other videos uh, on Mars, what I try and show you, and <clears throat> I have got a lot more, I just, I just haven't done them yet for you. Um, is, like the moon, Mars is absolutely covered in... Um, structures and uh, there's a lot of people missing a lot of things um, and uh, I will be showing you that, all that well you can start with the videos that I've got um just going to try and find a nice area but just looking at this is uh and this is something you will uh you'll get used to looking at how I mean, from this sort of height, this all looks very interesting. Why this all looks so completely different? Let's just put these. you can see it's been heavily photographed okay I should have just taken a screenshot on that area that we found straight off because now I'm a bit lost. This is odd looking. Oh, what is going on there? Okay. Let's. Oh, God, how do I take a picture? No. No. Oh, here we go. Right, maximum 
save image not Antarctica. Oh right, okay, right, hold on. Let's go. Google. Done a lot. Uh Okay, let's just do that. Might take a while. What's going on? Okay. Not sure what's happening, guys. Oh. Duh. Mars IT test or mess. Yeah, I think my oh, maybe that's worked. So we close that. Well, let's just uh. Go with that. Mars, there we go. And here we have it. Right. Okie doke. You can tell I don't know what the hell I'm doing. But okay. Right. Let's have a look. So. 1400. What are we at? 192. Okay, we'll leave that like that. For the moment. Okay. So initially, I'm just going to burn some of this. Yes, it's working quite slow. I tend to do this. Um, you wouldn't notice that so much if it was in black and white. Um, and this is all very quick. You don't have to uh, do it like this. I'll tell you what, let's... Um, turn that into black and white. See any... So you can't notice it now. Um, I just do that. It's easier to um, view it. So you don't have those bright sections sort of uh, shining in your eye. Okay. Now, like I say with all the videos, um, just pause and um, have a look. So you can see that this was, this is how 
nothing's been done apart from we've made it um, grayscale. Okay, so what we're going to do and uh, I'll probably knock this on the head quite quickly after we've done a little bit of this um, it's an experiment I had a spare half hour and um, I thought it might be interesting to do this um, Just to show you that the these uh, this research isn't just um, you know just with the NASA JPL stuff, <coughs> um, you can look at anything, any photograph, any subject matter, doesn't matter. It's all pretty much the same. So you can see I'm burning that those mid-tones I've really noticed this area it's quite weird with all this, this sort of striping in it and that could be something from the uh, the processing of the images right we're going to start there I can see this a mile off you think well, what is he looking at look at this area here in fact, the whole area, I can see it, it's all, um, and this is it, guys. This is how blatantly in your face this stuff is. do this as quickly as I can and you tell me what you think you can see appearing now if you've ever done this before and you've done it on the moon it's a bit of a different story the moon is so heavily edited um, it's crazy you really really have to search hard but this is just you start seeing it it's all starting to come together if you are new to all this sort of thing it's going to take you a while to get to grips with what I'm looking at You can hear that clicking noise. That would be my my uh, graphics tablet flying around the page. Okay. So 
So you can start seeing the pixelation coming through now. But what I'll do, I'll initially get to work down, explore the image, see what's going on. Before I start, before I enlarge it and then start refining it. Start seeing the structures forming now. I hope you can see what I'm looking at. Surprisingly enough, yet again, with the videos that I do, um, we, we're not simply looking at a sticky out, singular anomaly. We are looking at vast numbers of constructed um, buildings, uh, settlements, uh, industrial complexes. Um, it's difficult to put a label on it. I don't tend to label too much um, because the idea of the channel is to you know, instill some curiosity and um, in you, basically. I'll work on this area and then tell me what you think, because to me, you can see this is interconnecting. There are what look like tubes or, or pipes going under and over each other. Now, if you want to start doing this research, March, um, March, Mars is probably your best bet. Um, you pretty much can't fail. And if you want an idea of, uh, or you want to know where to find some images or which images to start with, um, just check out my uh, videos and tutorials and it will get you started. And if you have watched this from the start, this is how simple it is. And this is how blatant it is. And it, it purely, they just rely on the fact that um, they're relying on the fact that you're stupid and you can't see anything. And it's as simple as that. So at the end of the day, um, 
they're taking the piss out of you. Out of everyone. Just laying some burn down here. Back to the dodge and the highlights. What is that on? She's struggling to pull this out. So, this looks very, uh, constructed, made, um, if we pan out a bit, there's a platform with a tower sticking out the top, right there, I haven't even done anything to that. Another one here. Hopefully you can see this. If there's anything else. and it's this is it's everywhere. If you can't see what I'm looking at, and uh, you want me to go into this a little bit more, then just let me know, and I'll and I'll do that because the, you know, I don't think there's uh, any point in doing anything and keeping you guessing. Really, um, I want you to see. I want I want you to understand you know, what is going on. Well, I don't know what's going on. All I know is uh, this place is absolutely covered in terrain, which it clearly is not rocks. And if there was an area like this, which had really bizarre terrain, um, we'd know about it. But Mars is boring. There's some big mountains and craters and sand and uh, nothing. So you tell me. Pause it and check it out. And this image is uh, is full of it. I uh, haven't even enlarged this yet. We do that quick. Let's uh, let's chuck that up to see if it will make any difference for you. 
it might take a while. And you can slowly start seeing. Let's have a look there. An infrastructure um, appearing. Wow, this is a really uh, quite mental. All starting to take form, connecting. Wow, I will ch I will be checking my files out to see if I've got uh, any of these. Um, pictures, photos um, that have had work done to them. Um, so I thought this uh, just a little bit of fun, just to show you a different different side to just having a look at something different, basically, and. Um, Well, you can see what well, quite amazed. I don't normally give my view about this sort of stuff, but um, over the years looking at Mars, um, it's populated heavily. That's what I think. Check it out. There you have it. Google, just like that. Anyway, brilliant guys. Tell me what you think. Um, and would you like to see more uh, Google stuff? I've got um, some very interesting and shall we say sensitive stuff of uh, Google Earth as well. Um, I thought I'd get through how our planets and moons first before I get shut down. But there we go. That's another thing. Um, all right, guys. Cheers and nice one. Thanks for watching. Oh, and don't forget to like and share it. Just let people know about this. Okay, cool. Bye.